Good evening, I'm Justin Betty. As you just saw, polls close here across Wisconsin and many other states in about four minutes. Our Newswatch 12 reporters are spread out across the Northwoods in central Wisconsin tonight. We begin with Newswatch 12's Georgina Fernandez in Wausau. Georgina, what's it look like there? Yeah, Justin, even these last kind of 20 minutes, we still saw people trickling in and not even just people to just submit their votes, but also register. Now, I've been following registration all throughout the day, and they said they saw around 300 new voters today. And that's not when people who turned 18 or early 20s, and more during them were acting their 50s and 60s, casting their first votes ever today. And a lot of people coming today to re-register. Justin. All right, thank you, Georgina. Meanwhile, Newswatch 12's Andrew Goldstein is at the Hodag Dome in Rhinelander, the main polling location for all of Rhinelander today. Andrew, any lines there as polls close tonight? Yeah, there's really not much here. Things are just kind of wrapping up. But I would like to issue this PSA. We say it every single election cycle, but in this one, it matters more than most. If you are in line or you know anyone who is in line to vote as the polls close at 8 p.m., do not get out of line. As long as you are waiting online by 8 p.m., your vote has to count. They have to let you in. If you get out of line, then that does not have to happen and you will not be allowed to vote. So I don't imagine that many people in line have TVs and are watching us right now. But if you know anyone who is, text them, call them, tell them to stay in there, Justin. All right, thank you, Andrew. And Andrew did show that there was some big lines early this morning in Ryan. There's a lot of folks who did wait until today, did show up early this morning to vote, but it sounds like things have calmed down as the day has went on. So again, polls closing any minute now. No word yet on how quickly we may get some results tonight. We are not expecting to get final statewide results for things like the presidential race tonight. It might take too long to count. No word on how long that may take. We will be here with updates at 26 and 56 past the hour, right up until midnight. We'll also have updates on Newswatch 12 at 10. And don't forget, we have a number of races we are following tonight, including uh, every assembly race and, uh, and Senate, state Senate race in our state, a number of them, including the rematch in the Wisconsin Congressional District 7 between Tom Tiffany and Trisha Zunker. We'll have all of that for you coming up tonight on Newswatch 12 at 10. Polls close now in about one minute, so we should have updates soon. We'll see you back here again in about 30 minutes.